Hello everyone, so jumping straight into it. Before I wash my face, I like to start by washing my hands. Most of the time I'm getting straight out the shower so that isn't an issue and they're already clean from body wash because I really don't like to use Bath & Body Works on my sensitive skin, but that's what I had right here, so that's what I used. Next, I'll take a towel or a washcloth and wet that with warm water to open up my pores and get any crust out of my eyes if it's first thing in the morning because y'all know these lashes cause crust. Once my pores are open and my skin is moist, I go in with my Cetaphil Daily Facial Cleanser and my Gentle Skin Cleanser, the Walmart version, but the ingredients are the same for a lower price. And the Gentle was always too weak for my skin and the Daily was too strong, so I found that if I cut the Daily with the Gentle and mix them together, it's the perfect match. So I work that in with my hands and then I follow up with my spin brush as well. I lost my Clarisonic, so I have to use my Amazon version, but if y'all know of an affordable one that's just as good as the Clarisonic drop that below because I'm not trying to drop that money <laughs> also if I'm removing makeup at the end of the night I start off with baby wipes or Cetaphil makeup remover wipes before I begin this process and then I rinse off with warm water first and then my final rinse is always with cold water ice cold water as cold as it can go to close my pores the same way I do with my hair and close that shaft I close my pores with the cold water as well and then I just pat dry if my towel isn't the cleanest or I don't have a clean towel on hand then I'll just use paper towels or toilet paper <laughs> don't judge me next I go in with my witch hazel and a cotton round as my toner and I just work that in as well I just started using this weeks ago or maybe about a month now and I love the way it works and I just air dry that. Usually here I'll put on my lotion, but I have another product to show you all, so I'm not gonna go to that just yet. This baby is the newest addition to my skincare routine, or one of the newer additions. It is the Teamy Blends Detox Mask, and when I say it is everything, you see my excitement when I'm about to put it on. It's made with matcha tea, bentonite clay, and lemongrass, which are all amazing products. I used to use pure bentonite clay, so I was really excited to hear that it had that in it. And it literally tingles as you put it on. It feels so good. My skin did react to it the first time and burned a little, but once it set in and my skin got used to it, then I was good to go. And whenever you apply this, it's nice and thick. It lays on nice. It's just the perfect mask to use once or twice a week in addition to your skincare and have you feeling like you're fresh out of the spa. <laughs> I'm going to read off some of the benefits to that later on in the video, but you just leave that on sorry i got distracted by myself i just had to be a camera creep for a couple of seconds it recommends that you leave this on between 10 and 15 minutes so i go right in the middle and leave it on for 12 and now we just wait fake workout read a magazine you know <laughs> the norm And then also water and nutrition have also helped my skin to improve greatly over time. This is a skincare system called Specific Beauty that helped me get rid of my dark marks. I'm going to go to a clip of my skin at the end of 2016. If you've been with me for a while, you know I was struggling in the skincare department. I was so stressed out and I was experiencing a lot of breakouts, especially in the forehead region. And as a result, I was experiencing hyperpigmentation. So before I established the skincare routine that you see in this video, I used a specific beauty skincare line to really get my skin back on track and get those dark marks taken care of. And then also I'm going to show these pictures where you can really see how bad I was struggling. Like I barely wanted to go without makeup but better days have come. Aveeno Positively Radiant is a product that I've also recently started to use in the shower once a week. And then I also use my coconut oil all over my body because we know skincare is just not about the face. As you can see, the time ran out in the midst of me running my mouth. One negative about this mask is that you definitely have to put some elbow grease in to get it off. So I use my spin brush to help me rub that off. But I mean, it's high quality, it's thick, so it's thickness getting it off as well. But girl, once you get it off, when I say your skin will be on point, 
And then as promised, some of the benefits of this mask are that it helps remove blemishes from the skin, boost your antioxidants, nourish your skin, gives your face a nice glow with the lemongrass, it moisturizes and heals, and it has anti-aging properties. It's 75% organic and there's no animal testing for all of the environment friendly babes out there i'm just pat drying that off whenever it comes off and you feel so refreshed after you remove this mask like it's unbelievable and of course i can't let this video go by without giving you all a code so if you're interested use my code brianna18 for this mask and then going in with my cfl finally to moisturize and finish everything off most of the time i'll use that mask at night time that's also something i forgot to mention i hope you all enjoyed this skincare routine video it's the first on my channel let me know what you all think below check out teeny blends of course and i will see you all in the next one bye